Hello and welcome to a quick video where I will just be going over how you can play Diablo 2 or other Blizzard classic games without the in CD inserted to your disk drive. So the thing you need to first do is make a battle.net account. Most people probably have this if they have played the other Blizzard games in recent years, but if you haven't, you need to go to uh, US Battle.net account or EU for whatever language you're in, land, whatever, country and then you basically just make the account which takes about five minutes maybe less and then you go over to well I can quickly showcase it first now so there's the summary so yeah here's like my well all my different uh, games and whatnot that I have uh, installed or activated so when you're completely done this is how the page would look like if say you have all your classic games uh, ready to download but um, to do this you need to first just quickly go to uh, let's just see add a game key so if you don't have the original CD or the game key maybe you could actually just google some uh, you know fake game keys or whatever don't really think this is gonna work for perhaps online play cause say Diablo 2 the, the CD key is limited to only one login and whatnot. that can be a bit messy but maybe it could work for pinch or whatever if you really need to make it work but um, yeah as you know the digital key can be in, s in different places but it shouldn't be too hard to find and then you just basically just type it in and when that is done you just redeem the code and as soon as you redeem the code you go to the let's see the download clients and down here you get really good speed it would take about 10 minutes or so to get the classic games done nothing more than 10 minutes and as you see most of the games cannot be uh, gotten on Mac for classic games and that's just something you have to know but um, yeah I guess you already knew about that but um, yeah there's not much more to say about it so the only problem is that you have to start making a battle.net account if you haven't already yet then it's just basically going on from there as soon as you've done this you can even go as far as throwing out the CDs forever if you don't want to keep them anymore you don't uh, you don't have to ever worry about uh, keeping the CDs and if you don't want to keep them but um, yeah that's pretty much it hope you found this useful and I pretty much just wanted to make this video cause I got a comment about it who wondered how you can play Diablo 2 specifically without CDs so yeah I hope you found this useful and goodbye